Okay, the Hardwick Stakes up next, a one mile four group two event. Fairly small and select field. So number one, Dark Mistress for Django, the three to one favourite. Two, Absolute Tolly. Tolly for Alex Jerry. Three is Knight for David Robinson. Four, Mickey Blue Eyes, the second for Paul Rhodes. Five, Gravity for Joshua Sutherland. Six, Run Around Sue for Pontypool. Seven, Soap Opera for Molly at Surfer. And eight is the Afraid for Stu Gray. I like this horse, my one. They're in the gates. They're away. The only one that came out a little bit poorly was Dark Mistress. Just stumbled a little bit at the start there. But as they settle down, it's so proper that it takes us along. From Gravity and Knighted. Out wide is Absolute. The Grey, the Afraid. In that uh, unknown silks of mine, which is the uh, purple with, no purple, I suppose mauvey kind of violet. Violet colour silks with purple dots. Anyway. Mickey Blue Eyes has gone in front of him now and run around two against the fence and just the two at the rear of the Dark Mistress and Absolute. But we're being led by Soap Opera. He's got about a five length advantage from Gravity. Knighted is third. Mickey Blue Eyes is four. Run around Sue five. Dark Mistress six. The Afraid seven. And Absolute is eight. So with a mile left to go now, we've done the first half mile. Soap Opera still leads us from Gravity in second. They're all in Indian file here. Soap Opera's gone out and uh, dragged them out quite well here. It's going to be a race on from the beginning. And it's Soap Opera that leads by about four to Gravity. Knighted is third. And then length or so back to Mickey. Blue Eyes, Dark Mistress, run around Sue against the fence. The Afraid being pushed a little bit along now from Absolute. And it's still the Soap Opera. If you can hear all the roadworks in the background, I do apologise. They've been following him around for a few weeks now. Kind of a drilling sound. I hope it doesn't spoil the enjoyment, or at least maybe cover my voice. But up front, inside the five, it's Soap Opera from Gravity. United moving well on the outside now, and they're about three or four lengths ahead of Dark Mistress. Run around Sue, Mickey Blue Eyes, The Afraid, and Absolutely. They're well drawn out here. There's probably 20 lengths between first and last. I'm not sure they're going to anything but the first three are going to get into this. So it's Soap Opera that leads and heads for home in, as they hit the three furlongs. Soap Opera from Gravity, but he's five lengths down. Knight is still running on, running out of the pack now. He's Dark Mistress. Are they going to catch this leader? Soap opera. He's having it cut his lead cut into a little bit now by gravity as they hit the two furlongs and it's soap opera that leads from gravity. Dark mistress knighted and there's five, six back to the rest, but it's gravity that takes it up now. Inside the final furlong, Josh Sutherland horse just pulls away from everything else. Chasing hard now is Dark Mistress. Coming out of the pack and running on really well is the afraid. But it's an easy win for the gravity. Gravity's gonna take this. Wins it comfortably, wins by six. Fast finishing the afraid. Dark Mistress hung on to third. And it is Gravity takes it to Josh Sutherland by three and three quarter lengths. Second was the afraid by Stu Gray. I'm pleased with that one. I believe that might be my best ever for my best ever flat horse. Anyway, I shouldn't say that because Obi Wan will just give me such a high rate and it's stupid to open my mouth. Third was Dark Mistress of Django. Fourth was Knight for David Robinson. Fifth was Mickey Blue Eyes for Paul Rhodes.